Today I'm going to show you how to make some chocolate covered pretzels. So first you're going to need vanilla and chocolate candy coating, a sheet of wax paper, um, some pretzel rods, and food coloring. I used pink and I used two bags of pretzel rods. You're going to need three cups and three spoons. So also don't forget to wash your hands before you start to avoid any contamination um, in your pretzels. So first you're going to start by opening your bag of pretzels and laying out all of the pretzels on some wax paper. I started out by laying one bag of the pretzels, but you can lay out all of them if you have room. So next you're going to take one of your glasses and a spoon and you're going to open the vanilla candy coating and you're going to open it up and then you're going to take the candy coating and break it up into small pieces. So this one it already has folds but I used one of the chunks and you are going to put it in the glass and then microwave it for one minute. After one minute, open it up, give it a little stir, and then set it another, microwave it for another minute. So now you're going to stir it and make sure it's a good consistency. If it needs, if it's too um, solid, then you're going to need to put it in the microwave more, but it should be about this consistency. Then you're going to do this with the other two glasses and another chocolate and vanilla. And then you're gonna turn the second vanilla pink by adding some food coloring, which I'll show you how to do. So take your pink food coloring or whatever color you prefer. And I use gel coloring for this. So then you're going to put just a few drops in there, depending on how light you want the color, and then you're going to mix it up. This is a pretty light pink, so you can add more if you need. Make sure you stir it up really well. So you're going to stick a pretzel in and you're going to, if the cup doesn't fill all the way, you're just going to kind of scoop it on there and then you're going to smooth the chocolate and then once you have, let the chocolate drip off and then just set it on the wax paper. So here's one with vanilla. You just kind of place the frosting on the pretzel and you let it drip down and smooth it out. And don't worry if not all the pretzel is covered because when the chocolate dries, it will fill in the gaps. So you're gonna continue doing this until you've covered all your pretzels and at any time if your chocolate dries or becomes crumbly and hard to work with, just stick it back in the microwave. I would recommend doing it at shorter intervals, like 10 seconds, just so it doesn't burn. And then once you have a couple pretzels left, you're going to stick it and you're gonna cover it in chocolate and then instead of wiping off the excess, you're just gonna let it drip and you're just gonna do like a, you're gonna shake the pretzel and it will make a really pretty chocolate design and if you want more lines, you just make your arm movements bigger and I hope you liked this tutorial. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.